Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight fight. All right, to get us started now, here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, Derek the Black Beast Lewis. And now to his opponent, fighting out of the red corner, ladies and gentlemen, presenting the former UFC welterweight champion, Tyron, the chosen one, Woodley. Ready to fight? Ready. Good. All right, so here we are, Madison Square Garden, this arena. Not synonymous with winning when it comes to the NBA's New York Knicks, but certainly there have been a lot of big UFC moments here over the last few years. No championship for the Knicks, but when we fight here, somebody gets to take home a beautiful gold belt. Tonight, let's see how you perform in the world's greatest arena. Oh, beautiful hook there. Oh, nice defense. I thought that punch might get through. All right, so the great wrestler Tyron Woodley wanting to box tonight, DC, and that was a beautiful oh, Rock him, shock him out of the shoot here. Nice counter left there. Big right hand there. Ooh. Nice leg kick. Effective use of the jab there by the Black Beast. Well, this striker has come out swinging early, and you know his style is based on aggression, and largely it's worked out for him tonight. It's worked out phenomenal. He's fighting, and he's fighting exactly as he needs to if he wants to win this fight. Well, looks like Woodley's hook shot blocked, though, by the defense. Nice job getting that guard up to prevent any further damage. Picture-perfect shot there, DC, and one more of those, he might be out. I mean, the fight is going to be over. I can't believe he's still standing. That shot made the perfect. Now, he's masterful from here. Oh, he went to a single switch to a high crotch. Oh, my God, he switched the lock to a high crotch, rotated him, and took him for a ride. That was a big case. Oh, interesting there, as he just decides to let him back up. Past the two-minute mark in round one. Trying to go to the body here. Oh, oh he hurt him again, bro. That was not good. Nice try. High left. He's hooked now. Oh, with authority, the body. There it is, that's that one, that right hand. One minute to go in round one. Well, you saw the tail of the tape, he has a reach advantage and made good use of it there with that punch. Lewis's nose is blue. Back to his feet. And mixes in a takedown, why not? So under 30 seconds to go in what has been a pretty entertaining and active first round. Lewis is a stone jump driving out there. We'll see if he can recover. He's the fourth hand of the round. He got knocked down just before the horn, so he'll walk back to his corner here. We'll see if they can get him physically, mentally. All right, so he gets knocked down. You ready to fight? Ready. Round two here. Nice jab by the Black Beast. Able to block that one. Relax, relax. Woodley's eye now closing up. Nice one-two combination there. All right, now touches him with the left. Shots continue to rain down. Yes, yes, yes. Awesome, Kale.
set it inside the octagon for the official decision. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean is going to stop to this contest at one minute, 13 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout, Derek the Black Beast. Well, Derek Lewis might just be the UFC heavyweight champion of the world before this run is said and done. Congratulations to the Black Beast on yet another UFC triumph here tonight. And Lewis really starting to put all of his skills together under Bob Perez. That is a scary proposition for the rest of this heavyweight division. Of course, tonight, though, it is all about the Black Beast.